It's 2020. Are you certified yet? I don't mean mentally, I mean are you certified for your technology knowledge? My name is Alexa Morales and here's how I passed the Oracle Cloud Infrastructure Foundation's 2020 Certified Associate exam and how you can too. I'm going to share with you some proven tips for passing this exam. If you stick around to the end of the video, I will share the number one secret that I used to pass this exam. The first thing you're going to want to do is sign up for the learning path. And if you're an Oracle employee, you must complete 80% of that path to then sign up for the free certification exam. Otherwise, it's $95 for the exam. Go through the learning path and take the practice exam until you know every answer. Once you've done that, you're probably gonna be like me and you're gonna be raring to go think, I'm golden, let me go take this exam. It can't be that hard. Well, I did that and I did not pass. I was gonna have to be a little bit more methodical about this. The next step is, to purchase this Udemy course. It may be on sale for $12.99 or it may be around $20. The pro tip is go into Udemy and search for the name of the particular certification exam that you are looking to practice for. And there are many from many vendors. The only thing I suggest you do is be really careful that it is exactly the exam you want because these exams do change over time and sometimes there will be older material there. And I'm talking about any vendor, not just Oracle. Also, you'll find that when you do take that Udemy course, you have three exams that you can practice with and that's so useful. And you'll see once your score is, you'll see more importantly, when you have wrong answers, you can drill down on all of those answers and click back to the original documentation on that. So that is just so useful. It will really help you have an understanding. This next level is how to take it a little bit deeper. And to be honest, it's not required. I think you would do fine if you didn't do it this way, but this will really help you have a picture of what exactly you're learning. So I suggest you go get your free Oracle Cloud trial. And then I suggest you go follow a beginner level tutorial at the learning library on Oracle's GitHub. That will let you set up a cloud instance and then you can play around with the command line shell and you are gonna feel like a real TV ninja hacker once you start doing that. And that workshop is gonna help you understand identity and access management. It's gonna help you set up virtual cloud networks, create a compute instance, understand various forms of storage like block volume and object storage. So I really recommend that you do that. Once you have all that, you really are ready to go. Once you've practiced everything, given some time to review, you can either go in person to a testing center or you can use the online proctoring through Pearson View. And it works really great. However, my pro tip there for you is get everything set up and you're gonna have a clear glass of water but no mug, no writing material, no pen, your phone can't be nearby. And once they've approved your workspace, you're going to have to wait for the proctor to show up and that can take a while, 15 to 20 minutes. And in this day and age, that can seem like an eternity. You've got nothing to entertain yourself with. You can't have written material, you don't have your phone. And if you leave the room, you could be disqualified. So just be prepared mentally do some yoga, maybe meditate, maybe bring your ukulele and practice your strumming. Once you've done all that, you're golden. You get a badge that you can share to your social media sites and that shows that you're somebody who's focused on their career, focused on improving your skills. What else do you gain from something like that? Well, obviously you gain this expanded knowledge base that you can then use to make more money. And that is proven that people with certifications do make more money, definitely take advantage of that. And if you go to any of the new cloud native conferences like KubeCon, you will see that every brand name company that you've ever heard of is scrambling to find the talent to both build and describe, which is kind of what I do, describe these cloud native applications that are running their businesses. So this is your opportunity to get in on that. You're gonna also understand something that is really changing right now during this pandemic. And that is online education, online learning. And you're gonna understand what works for you and also what works for everybody. And who knows, maybe you'll build the next big online education platform based on this experience. Finally, you will get that sense of accomplishment and sense of group membership. And that leads me to my secret tip on how to pass this. And that is teamwork. The truth is I must give a lot of credit to my boss at the time and the group that I was with that worked together as a team for several weeks, focused on the best resources, on practicing, on inspiring each other. Just having that accountability, not wanting to be the one person who didn't pass or who didn't even try, you know, that really is helpful. So I really recommend finding somebody with whom to be accountable. And I think you'll find it, it really gives you a tangible feeling of accomplishment 
even in this very intangible world that we're living in right now. Because ultimately, you know, what they say about goals, it's not so much the piece of paper that you gain in the end, it's who you become in the process of trying to attain that goal. So with that, I hope you're inspired to go out and get this certification or any others. I know I'm inspired to try to go to the next level and maybe get architect certificate. There's also Java certifications that I'm interested in. And maybe I'm gonna get scuba or yoga or personal training. Who knows, the sky's the limit. Please share in the comments below any certifications that you've gotten and what you thought was valuable about that. Thanks for watching. Please comment and subscribe.